Mike, there was hope that Hamler's injury wasn't as serious as it appeared, but that hope was dashed today. They had hoped that because he tore an ACL, and I believe it was on the same knee, in high school, his senior year in high school, and they thought that maybe, you know, that's what caused the pain and, and kind of looked bad there as he was getting carried off the field. They were hoping for an MCL, LCL. But, yeah, the uh, MRI uh, tells the whole story, and it did show a tear. So he's had two of these things uh, really bad for the Broncos because they lose a lot of speed. You know, K.J. didn't have a lot of catches or a lot of production, but he helped set up the other guys to get catches in production because he was the guy you had to worry about. So much speed. Well, what was once a deep position is now a thin one. Fortunately, Cortland Sutton's been good to go again, and Tim Patrick continues to impress. There's definitely no replacing KJ. Um, just replace it by making plays. That more balls for other people, and when the ball comes away, just make a play. It might be not be, might not be in a way that he would do it, but there's other ways to make big plays. Mike Tim Patrick has been great this season. Caught everything that's come his way. Yeah, nice game yesterday. Five catches, 98 yards. He's really been the guy to, to uh, replace Jerry Judy. Uh, you know, they're going to need Jerry Judy back at some point this season. But I'm not sure who is uh, can really replace K.J. Hamler in that speed. They used Deontay Spencer, Kendall Hinton, people know from uh, playing quarterback last year. And they have four receivers on their practice squad. And we'll see if George Payton brings in uh, some other receivers from outside the building, either through a tryout or signing off practice squads elsewhere. Won't be Josh Gordon, though. He's with the Chiefs. So we know K.J.'s done for the year, Mike. What do we know about Dalton Reisner and Graham Glasgow, though? Reisner is walking around well. Uh, I think he's day-to-day. -day. I'm sure he'll be questionable for the game against the Ravens on Sunday, but he'll have a chance to play. <clears throat> I'd be very surprised if uh, Graham Glasgow plays. Uh, he's more week-to-week -week, uh, with that knee injury after he got rolled up. Friendly fire from right tackle Bobby Massey yesterday.